was working! <laughs> okay, it's ready. Maybe I should just stay here. Don't give up, Vim. Tweak will figure something out. Vroom. Hmm. Wow, walk when you can roll. With this wheel from my gut, Bam, you won't need to walk on your front leg. How's that feel? Weird. Maybe I should just wait until my leg feels better. Sure, that's such a good idea. Maybe it's another recent. No, not a recent. It's definitely a bear, and he looks hungry. Hey, who's been eating all my roots and berries? Oh no, I am doomed. Don't worry, Vim. I'll be right here with you. Vroom. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll be okay as long as the bear doesn't see us. But even from this distance, he might smell us. <laughs> Oh, we've got to get out of here. Oh, you can do it. Mm. Oh, oh. Okay, I'll try. Huh. Oh, I, I think I'm getting the hang of this. That's good, because the hungry-looking bear spotted us. A weasel. Yum. <laughs> Forget roots and berries. You look much tastier. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear! To the meadow! <laughs> Hang on, Periwinkle! Uh, hey! Snacks! Come back! <laughs> That's it, Bim! You're doing it! Oh, I like fast food, but not that fast! Oh. I can't see them. They're on their way. And fast! Change of plan, Peso. We need to lift off right away. <gasps> Blappity flippers. Is that a bear? <laughs> Come on, Vim. You can do it. You want me to go in bed? Don't worry, Vim. I'm here with you. <clears throat> vroom, vroom. My snack is flying away. All right, back to my berries. There they are. Huh? Where'd they go? <laughs> <laughs> Give them back. Those eggs don't belong to you. Yeah. <laughs> That was much easier than I thought it would be. Yeah, hard to believe they just ran away. I'm not sure they were running from you. Lunny, what are you doing up there? Keeping away from them. Mm, looky here, exotic food. Ooh, fancy and tasty. Mm. Esteban, nobody messes with our friends. Why not, Ronnie? Shh, Lunny, back me up here. Okay. Listen to their adorable little hiss. What you gonna do? Spit at us? If you are smart, you will stay away from my whipping tail. Fine. Forget it. We'll find food elsewhere. Oh, you boys did real good. <laughs> yeah. How did we know how to do that? Because that's what Nile monitor lizards do. You're used to defending yourselves from lions. Hmm. I reckon you fellers are gonna be all right, especially if you stick together. I told you, everything was fine. Hey, this place, maybe not so bad. Nothing here we can't handle. Of course. You're all back where you belong. Now, let's get these eggs back where they belong. Oh, do we have to? <laughs> so, those silly monitor lizards managed to fit in after all. Yep, I should have known I couldn't stop them fellers from getting into trouble in their new home. 
but I sure feel better knowing they can get themselves out of it just fine. <laughs> All of those cones are full of caterpillars. Looks like there's plenty for both of us. Yum! And what about other creatures who might want to eat these caterpillars? Seems like a lot of things could be hiding in this grass. Hmm, that's true. Dashi, I'd like to stay and keep watch over them. And I'll stay too, to work on my map of the area. Good idea. I'll come back for you when the caterpillars turn into butterflies. Rise and shine, Guillermo. We moved everyone to this new area with plenty of plantains. This is fantastic! Everybody, wake up! Time to eat! Our tummies are full, it's time to make our chrysalises so we can turn into butterflies. The next time you see me, I'll have wings. Wish me luck. Good, Good luck. luck. It won't be long now before they hatch out of their chrysalises as butterflies. We didn't get to eat the caterpillars, but chrysalises are tasty too. Let's, Let's go, go for, for it. it. Chrysalises! Quick! We have to stop them! <laughs> oh! Ah. Oh! They're fast! And hungry! Oh! Wolvermel! <laughs> How about some bramble biscuits? <laughs> nope. No thanks. What was that? <gasps> Something's coming! <gasps> what is it? Hang on! <laughs> it's Tunit! What? <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> well done, Tunit! <laughs> Caterpillars have turned into butterflies. Wow! I'm sticking to this tree no matter what. I'm afraid we can't go anywhere either. Our egg is about to hatch, so I sealed up our nest to keep them safe. Them? Are you saying Mrs. Hornbill is sealed inside there too? Only for five months? Just until our chick is old enough to fly? It's not so bad. There's a little hole where I bring them food. But they're not going anywhere for now. We can't risk harming the hornbills. Looks like we'll have to move this tree upright. It'll be a little wobbly, Kip. But the Cherub One can handle it. I can use my map to lead you on the smoothest path to the safest location, just across the river. Excellent. Wazi and I will stay behind to make sure a teeth doesn't follow you. Careful around the roots, Tweak. Whoa! Careful! Sorry about that, Mrs. Hornbill. We'll be fine. Just as soon as we make it across that rope bridge. Hey! Where'd my scratching tree go? Now, Atif, I'm sorry, but the creatures in that tree were in danger, so we had to move it. Plenty more trees in the forest, matey. We can help you find one, like this one. Sleek, stylish, a real itch scratcher. But I want my scratching tree. <sighs> hey! Come back with that. <sighs> 
That's it, Tweak. Slow and steady. Yes, steady is good. Please be careful. My wife and chick are inside. Uh, I can do the slow part, but not so sure about steady. <laughs> oh, no, no. Forget slow. A teeth is right on our tail. Hold on, a teeth. Let me pass. That's my scratching tree. No can do, matey. There are creatures in that snag. <gasps> oh no! Tweak, open the hatch. Everyone join in. Right, let's go.